Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. As you can tell by the title and thumbnail of this video, I am doing my first Q&A. So I'm really excited to answer some questions that you guys asked me over on my Instagram a couple of weeks ago and just tell you a little bit more about myself. But before we get started, if you are new here, make sure you hit that subscribe button and the little bell right next to it so you get notified every time I upload a video and make sure you give this video a thumbs up if you enjoy it. So I'm just gonna start off telling you guys a little bit about myself since I've never done one of these and this may be your first time here on my channel. My name is Amy and I am almost 24 years old. My birthday is in February, so it's coming up here soon. And I'm a mom of two. I have a 22 month old son named JJ and I have a two month old little girl named Olivia Rose. And we are currently living in Washington state, pretty close to Seattle. My husband is in the military, but I am originally from Georgia. I was born and raised there. My husband and I were also high school sweethearts. We met when I was 16 years old and he was 17 years old. We've been together ever since. This year we will have been together eight years and married for six years, which is crazy. Okay, the first question is how do you manage house chores and kids? So it is not easy. I actually got this question again the other day on one of my Instagram stories and it's not easy some days my house is a complete disaster and it stays that way just because i don't always have the energy to get it done or the time to get it done and that's okay too because sometimes i just need to spend time with my kids and cuddle my kids but on a daily basis i will usually get most of my like house cleaning done during jj's nap so he still takes about a two hour nap every day and so that gives me a lot of time to get a lot of housework done. And also I will do the dishes and vacuum and things like that after he goes to bed. My husband can be with Olivia or sometimes he will help me pick up the house. That's really how I just try to stay on top of it is getting things done at night and during the kids nap time. The next question is why did you start a YouTube? So my husband was the one who encouraged me to do it. It was his idea and he really pushed me to do it. But I really thought it would be a lot of fun, just a hobby for myself because after I had JJ, I knew I wasn't going to be working for a while. I'm the type of person who doesn't want to put my kids in daycare or hire a nanny for them. So I knew I wasn't going to be working. I was going to be at home. I needed something to do to keep me busy. So really it started off as a little hobby, but I love it. I am trying to work really hard to possibly make it become a career. Do you ever feel homesick and how is it being an army wife? Yes, I feel homesick. We only have a couple of friends here. We have no family near us and we definitely miss having a lot of people around and a lot of people to spend our time with. It's hard being away from family, especially when we have kids and how is it being an army wife? I personally don't mind it that much at all. I am not a big fan of the moving around and moving to different places and not knowing people and just getting resettled everywhere we go. But as far as like his job and everything. He has an amazing job and he gets to be home with us a lot. It's basically, he leaves in the morning, he comes home at night. He doesn't have to go away for training a lot. He has never been deployed yet. So from that aspect, it's great. I don't have a problem being an army wife. Next question is, do you move often? So we were at our first duty station in Georgia for I think about three and a half years. And then we've moved up here to Washington. We have been here for a little over two years and we will be moving again pretty soon. So about every two to three years is how often we move. The next question is where has been your favorite place to live so far? Definitely Georgia. We have only been in two duty stations. Have you ever been through a deployment? No. My favorite and least favorite part about being a military wife. My favorite part is probably just the stability of my husband's job and it is nice to be able to like travel around a little bit and see different places even though that's not ideal for us we would like to settle down somewhere and just be in one place but it has been nice to be able to travel across the country and see a bunch of places that I had never seen before and my least favorite part is probably the same moving around and being in different places not being around our family and our friends and the unknown of whether my husband is going to have to leave at some point and how long he will have to be gone for. So the last question is how do you cope with stress? The thing that stresses me out the most probably is just like an unclean house when the house is messy or when I get behind on things. So for me, I like to plan. I use a planner. I use notepads. I use my phone 
and I write stuff down and I make a plan. I make a plan pretty much every day of the things that I want to accomplish that day. And that helps me stay on top of everything. That helps me to stay on top of everything and keep my stress level down. If I do get stressed about other things or my children stress me out, the biggest thing is like talking to my husband. We will talk about things that stress me out and that will help me calm down or figure out a solution of how to minimize that stress. So staying organized and talking to my husband is how I cope with my stress. So that was all the questions that I got on my Instagram for this Q&A. I got so many compliments on this shirt. This was the one I was wearing in the picture I posted on Instagram and I've worn it a lot and a lot of people have said they really like it. So I got this shirt from Amazon. I got it for Christmas. It is incredibly comfortable and it's just really good quality. So I'm gonna link that down below because I've gotten so many compliments on it. I wanted to share it with you guys. But that is going to be it for today's q and I hope you guys enjoyed it. I really enjoyed doing this Q&A and getting all the questions from you guys. So if you would like to see another Q&A, let me know down in the comments and leave me some more questions. You can also go to my Instagram and leave me some questions there and maybe I will do another one of these. But thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe if you're not already, and I'll see you guys very soon in my next video.